Now there's something uh, right here that you don't see every day, right? A cruise ship along the Detroit Riverfront. The ship made port for the day, allowing passengers a chance to check out our fine city. We sent Megan Woods to check it out as well, and she quickly learned word had gotten around. It is incredible. This Viking ship is the biggest and most modern ship on the Great Lakes right now, and today is its very first time in Detroit. And while it's the tourists who are boarding this ship, the locals are the ones coming out here, getting out their phones, snapping photos, and trying to take in this special moment. It speaks for itself. This is really cool. And this is definitely the real deal. This ain't no, this ain't no Rudy Poo size ship. <laughs> All aboard the Viking Octanis. As part of a Great Lakes cruise, the ship goes from Toronto to Milwaukee, and Detroit is just one of the ports they stop at along the way. People like Bryce Harding couldn't wait for the inaugural voyage. To have something that can carry passengers, that's that means big money for Detroit, so I'm excited about that. He wasn't the only one. Dozens of people showed up. We thought we'd love to do a cruise, but can a cruise ship fit on the Great Lakes? I said it's impossible. Where are they going to park it? Michael and Pamela Caldwell drove 60 miles. Never seen nothing like this before. I don't know if we ever will again, except on TV. Now that they've seen Viking Octanis in all its glory, the question remains, will they ever become a passenger? No. <laughs> no. Absolutely. Easily. And quickly. Yeah, I was just on the phone with my mom. She loves water and to have something this close that I can get her to, you know, this is this is a no brainer. And that ship took off uh, two o'clock this afternoon. It's heading to Alpena and from there, Mackinac Island. It ends in Milwaukee. Back to you, Jason. Megan, what's the story with this ship? By the way, is this uh, uh, something we can expect to see more of in the future? This is just the beginning. So Viking has a, a several series coming through here for the spring and summer, and then they plan on adding another ship. Very cool and a lot of great uh, seas to navigate through the Great Lakes for sure. All right, Megan, thanks.